Hello and welcome to Danger Zone. Mwah. Um, it's trick or treat time. So the way this works is mm -hmm. the pumpkins are worth nothing. Okay. The bugs are worth nothing. In fact, they're worth less than nothing. Wait, bugs. Um, but those are all thousand chips in the back. Got it. And there's 18 of them. Okay. So the buy-in is, uh, um, the buy-in is, um, the buy-in is actually $9,000. <laughs> um, $9,000, that's half of what we can win back. Okay. That's great. Um, it's a little steep, but okay. Yeah, it's pretty steep, but hey, welcome to Trick or Treat. You, we will, we will trick you and you will be our treat. <laughs> um, so we have, uh, where's my phone? Is that your phone or my phone? This is your phone. Okay. I just want to make sure my phone's off. Okay, so we got, uh, we got 15 minutes for $9,000. Would you believe it? I'm not happy. No, I didn't think it would be. Maybe you should drink some of that death elixir we have over on the side. Maybe. Um, Can I play? Yeah, go ahead and play. You know, if you're short on uh, if you're short on Halloween supplies, they have them at uh, Pharmacon. Really? Halloween cards, Halloween candy. Ooh. Even sugar-free Halloween candy for people in my situation. No way. Yep. Aren't going to be for Halloween this year, or are we not dressing up? Well, I was wondering if he should go out in his suit. Okay. Get him a little briefcase. Okay. But we can ask him. Oh, they got the pants to fit right? Yep. Everything is good. Hanging in the gallery closet. Good. So he doesn't wash it. That's exactly. So just to break even, we have to get nine of those. Uh... Hey, okay, one of them's down on top of a pumpkin. They're starting to push the pumpkins aside. And I bet their Halloween cards are half price. They definitely are. They have a long tradition of half price cards. That's why I love it. You're putting your arm in front of the camera again. Oh, I'm sorry. Lower it. Your arm? Sure. That'll solve the problem. I'll just have your arm lowered. See, what we don't usually talk about with that Brit has movable limbs. Mm -hmm. You just pull them off and stick them in somewhere else. Like a, like a Lego person? Yeah, exactly like a Lego person, especially with the hat. <laughs> yes, and a completely blank expression on her face. I didn't even know they, uh, you know, they probably do have Lego brides. Maybe you should get a Lego bride outfit for your wedding. Wow, no. Do you have the wedding address picked out already? Oh, God, yeah. Ooh. I'm in the process of waiting for it. It's coming from Greece. Okay, we're getting a lot of pumpkins off, but we haven't gotten any uh, thousand chips off yet that I know about. Want to split some of these quarters and play? I have a whole thing of quarters of my own. Okay. 
You want me to try? Yeah. Think I can do any better? No. I didn't think so. Then why do you want me to try? Oh, your finger's hurting. Britt's finger still hasn't healed up. They may have to amputate. Oh dear, I hope not. Tell them how it happened. I was using a mandolin trying to slice potatoes. You should just get one of the machines that uh, Aaron has. But that doesn't slice the potatoes. Well, it, well, it doesn't make them... No, they the... said thin sliced potatoes. You know what you do? You go to the supermarket and you go to the freezer section and you buy a bag of, of thin sliced potatoes. My mom said, my mom goes, why didn't you get the canned potatoes? <laughs> oh, I think we're getting close to a... Actually getting some value chips off. What? Nothing. I forgot to. I think I forgot to punch in. That's okay. They'll correct it. I don't make you punch in the coin pushing. No. I don't want to think. I just make you a. Uh... Can we still email the old person, or do we get a new person? You got a new person. Okay. Just email me. Okay. Oh, speaking of which, mm -hmm. um, you popped up as uh, overtime again. For what, a minute? Three minutes this time. You're, you're slipping. Oh, my goodness. But they said three minutes doesn't matter. It's really ridiculous, though. The computer is really too sensitive. I suppose if you work three minutes extra a day for ten days in a row, that would be thirty minutes. So they have to watch it, but... No! Nope. It just doesn't make any sense. You're coin pushing with one side and trying to punch in with the other. I don't even know why I'm bothering Chris so much faster at this. Now that her finger's just a little bit shorter. I really like these monsters. The zombies? Mm -hmm. I feel like they're like attacking my quarters. They are. I love the one that's upside down. Yeah, he's like, I had it with this too. Yeah, they're just, the music system is stuck. You're playing the same song over and over. But it's a good song. It's probably trying to torture us. But the people who work here, yeah. So, you, you said the paintings are in the trunk? Uh, the prints are in the trunk in cardboard bag. Okay. I mean boxes, not bags. And can we take them out and we can open the boxes so we know what prints we have, that would be great. Perfect. And how did it go with the people that bought one? Um, well, I'm, it's, to that, you, you guys framed a bunch of those uh, Neptune, of those gas giant ones, mm -hmm. right? That's good because the frame broke. 
on the way there. Okay. So, uh, I have to bring her over another one tomorrow. I'm just going to swap it out. Is it far? No, it's like 15 minutes from here. I don't know if you wanted me an orange or just get Well, tomorrow is Tuesday? Mm-hmm. What's on the schedule for Tuesday? The gym. Let me find out when it's good for her. You and Aaron can do it. I don't know if, I haven't been paying attention. I don't know if we've gotten nine of those down yet. We have five minutes left. I don't know if we've gotten any now. Got a lot of pumpkins down. So the pumpkins are just there to get in the way. And they're doing their job very well. I have no idea what to get Charlie for his birthday. Is it a, are you cutting out a little close? Yeah, just a little bit. I'm never like this. Normally I have presents, like, I have people's Christmas presents already bought. Well, you know, there's a tradition. You could just show up wearing nothing but, you know, show up wearing nothing but wrapping paper. No. No? Um, nothing but saran wrap? No. Okay, so that's all out. It's a physical present. A physical? What are, what are you, spirit? It's not like a laptop. You're not a phantom, know. you know. I don't know if you want a laptop. I don't know what else. I know one thing. He doesn't want to get Aaron's camera ready. No. He doesn't. How's your cousin working on it? Good. It's ready for pickup. Gotta tell a means to make sure it's charged every night. I'm sorry, what's charged every night? The camera. Oh. My turn, my turn. Stop hugging the slot. Hmm. I know, get him venom stuff. I was thinking that, but I don't even know like what. But I also, I'm, I don't want him to have any more toys. But he loves toys. Yeah, but not anymore. I know, get him a coin pusher machine. No, I think he would like the, a claw machine. A claw machine? Get him a claw machine. I don't want that in my house. It's not in your house It's right now. It's your mother-in-law's house. She don't want it in her house either. And we are in the process of looking at houses. So it is not coming with us. Hey, there has to be a garage or a... No. Man cave of some kind. No. Nothing. 
Look how much I enjoy the, uh, the man cave my cow let me go. Yes, after you've had a child and raised it and let it go off on its own. Right. Yes, we're not at that stage yet. I must have gotten something by now. Oh, Why don't you pause and do a clean out? Why did we? So we could see. Yeah, but I like I like the curiosity. Okay, that's what we need to clean out. Okay, we're going to pause for a clean out. And we're back from the clean out. We got lots of orders, that's all I can say. Come on, we're very close. The zombie that was stuck over there has gotten knocked, getting knocked down. Does he count for anything? No. He's just, you know, they have the lawn zombies. Mm. They do, actually. And then Aaron bought a pumpkin for outside the magic house today. A real pumpkin or no, a car? No, a plastic one that lights up. Oh, okay. You have to plug it in or it's batteries? Batteries. Is it on all the time or is it just go on at night or whatever? It depends on what you want to do with it, I think. He's very into the Halloween area. Well, you know, you can just ask him what he wants to be for Halloween. He'll tell you. Oh, yeah. I just wasn't sure if we were still doing it this year. Halloween is the National Applied Behavior Analysis Holiday. I keep explaining it. What happened? What do you do? What is the whole process of trick-or-treating? I know. You ring the doorbell. You say what you need to say, and then they give you a reward. And they give you a reward, yeah. What are you texting over there? Pay attention to the game. I was seeing what day of the week Halloween one. Thursday. So I guess I'll go out early. Yeah, Aaron usually goes out around 5. 
and it can only go for an hour. Unless if you want to see for me, it will take them out longer. Yeah, I, um, well, it's not like someone is inexperienced with taking autistic kids that we, we can ask him. Trust me, in, in that hour, He'll rack up a lot. He'll rack up plenty. And he doesn't eat it. I know. Okay, I guess we have to do a clean out. Hold on, guys. Hey, guys, we're back. We didn't get any thousand chips. We did get a zombie. And how many pumpkins did we get? Some good news for you, my friend. Yeah. Manager just came over and said, This is Halloween, right? Trick or treat? Mm -hmm. The trick is the thousand chips were one nut were worth nothing. And the pumpkin chips were worth five hundred each. Oh. How many were there again? Twenty two, I believe. Yeah, twenty two. So that means we won eleven thousand dollars? Yes, minus the nine thousand. So we got we, two. Yeah. We got two thousand. <laughs> trick or treat. I like this trick. Yes. Um but let me uh show you guys a little something. And okay guys, uh, here are all the elixirs that were on the side of the uh um on the side of the machine. Um I just want to thank uh, Gowanus Gaming for letting me show them off. Um this is a uh this is a um, Jack's Death, which is why it has all the skulls in it. And this is uh, another poison. Um, and this is a bunch of uh, um, dried uh, toads and other um, fish. Let's see what this is. This is. Oh, this is spider blood. But I want to make it very clear that none of these elixirs are available at Pharmacon. These are bats. Just baby bats. These are spiders. And you can, you know, all... This is an elixir. I'm not sure what it does. Um, but uh, it's definitely an elixir, I can tell you that much. Um, more bats. Etc. Etc. Oh, this is great. This is a uh, dried eye of newt. See all the eyes of newt. Anyway, like I said, you can't get any of this at Farmercon, but you can get it um, by just uh, dropping a note um, to me, and I'll pass it on to Gowanus Games. And uh, um, if you, you know, if you have some friend who desperately needs, uh, I don't know, a cure or death. Um, then uh, this is just the right place for them. 
So, uh, um, thanks for watching, guys. Could, if you could share this to, you know, all the potential murderers and poisoners and, uh, you know, I don't know, biochemists that you have, you know, that would be great. We're on a big sharing push because we want to get our uh, subscriber base up so that we can uh, bring lots of you a happy Halloween and a nice trick-or-treat to you. They certainly pulled one on us. And, uh, um, I guess so we'll see you in the next game. So, Brit already left, but I'll say uh, ciao-ciao for her and ciao-ciao for me. Talk to you later. Bye.